Alrighty folks, the footage you will see from today is from the Cletus and Cars and the Freedom 500 at the Freedom Factory. If it looks like fun to you, you should come to our next event, which is May 14th and 15th at Lucas Oil Raceway in Indianapolis. We're doing a huge Crown Vic race with a bunch of YouTubers and a huge burnout competition. Lucas Oil Raceway is actually pouring us a burnout pad next to their drag strip and we're having a top 32 streetcar shootout as well. It's gonna be an incredible weekend. Again, Indy, we will be there May 14th and 15th. You can buy tickets on the Lucas Oil Raceway website. I'll put a link in the description, but let's get to the live action. Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me Fun YouTube channel. <laughs> the upside down mobile. That's <laughs> short. Dude, painted his cage? Holy crap. Sucker's clean. Hey, Dave, I'm really proud of you. Are you? I'm really proud of you. Number nine. Number nine. DeBerti, you beat me. There's the sheet right here. Did you use nitrous? No, I didn't use nitrous. Did you? I mean, I have to oh! On the list of qualifying. Yeah, dude, you're number nine. nine. Top ten. We're in Tanner. Really, dude? Can I do that to us? That's it. You're number one, dude. Yeah! Unreal. You and Connor are our front row. Yeah, look at how tight the field is for 20 oh Crown Vicks. 20 retired Crown Vicks, ranging from 50,000 miles to 200,000 miles. So the real question is, is it gonna rain? No, I think we're good. If it rains, it rains. It's gonna be awesome. I don't even care. It's gonna be so <laughs> All right. Hey, thanks again for doing that. Hey, good okay. job, dude, on the pole. One, two, three. Ah! One, I already lost two, my voice. Three. This is the best racing we've ever had. Oh, hands down. Look at the whole pack. Oh! 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 That could have been so much That could have been bad. I think Deegan's got him. the cap I bet. Please the cars speak on baby
Dude, you guys have no idea how good that feels. Oh! Who was here when I wrecked it last time? Our boy is back. Let's hear it for Toast. Folks, we are shutting down after one hell of a weekend. All right, guys, so the weekend went amazing, but now we're back at the Freedom Factory. We are uh, getting the ribs all fired up, left the batteries on on this, so we jump started it. It's nice, got it running. Oh, yeah. We got some videos to make with this bad girl this week. I'll do Jump, run over stuff, go through things, yep. jump through a house, you never know. You know the deal. What's the deal with white trash? After 150 something thousand miles and all them burnouts, the starter finally quit. <laughs> of all things. Dude, unbelievable. You know, George lost a turbine wheel out of his oh, I turbo. See, I was watching his burnout and they said, I seen the liquid balls of death flying out the one exhaust pipe. Yeah. I said, oh, that's a turbo. Yeah, no more Amazon turbos. We're not doing it anymore. It's too dangerous, dude. The freaking turbine wheel shot off into the grass and then a fan found it and brought it up to George. He said, hey, I think you dropped this. Yeah. It's a whole exhaust wheel. Yeah. So as you guys know, May 15th, we have Cletus and Cars Indy. We'll be racing around the half mile with the Crown Vicks. In the driver's meeting, I really stressed that we needed clean racing so that we could take most of the cars to Indy. Some of the cars, not gonna make it. Yeah, some aren't, I mean, look at this one. Brad's is good. Was this even race or is this just- Dude, Brad good? was in the top three the whole race, so we just cleaned this one up and we're good. Yeah, this one's a solid, you know, a little yeah. couple bumping that going on, but other than that, this is Yeah, solid. like my radiator blue, that's all in mine. And then solid, we got a couple that are wrecked up pretty good, so yeah. we're gonna be replacing those, but a lot of these cars I think we'll be able to- Yeah, a lot of these are really solid yeah. Yeah, Some of them really good. I know like Heavy D's destroyed. Yeah, that one's But good. dude, the guy raced a good race. He made it a long way. 80 laps. Yeah, he did good. And he was like racing really clean. And then his Watts link broke when he got hit. So we're uh, yeah. we're on to something here. Let's look at Connor Daly's car down there. Yeah, Connor Daly's car is mint. Tanner Faust car for sure can be clean. How do you think that half mile is going to do? I think it's going to be a good race. I think it's going to be a lot of shifting. The though. ability to gain the gap is going to be huge there because you got a whole lot more area. But. Yeah. I don't the car should after the testing we did leading up to the race and seeing yeah. what we did the pre-race cars we took dirty 30 cars that already ran the Lamullets race and straight beat the heck out of them for a day and a half just ran just practice hard, yeah and they they didn't quit so i, I think we'll be fine on the half mile oh, it'll be yeah the cars will be fine they'll yeah. go faster though which might you might see some it might get a little sketchy yeah. yeah all right so guys i was going to finish off this video talking about the freedom 500 pay-per-view and the cleasing cars pay-per-view and what we were going to improve on and the technology issues we had but that's going to come out tomorrow on the cletus 2 channel we just found out um, some information on some of the attacks that we had on the website and uh i can speak more accurately on it tomorrow so we will come back with that I'll just put out a short video on the PS2 channel, but that is it for now. Thanks for watching Do It For Dale. We will freaking see you later.